In this section, we're going to discuss campus network design concepts. This is typically part of the campus network design and operations workshop taught by the Network Startup Resource Center. As we've traveled around the world and helped people with their campus networks, we've uncovered and discovered that there are a number of common challenges that, that we've seen all throughout Africa and Asia and even in the U.S. These challenges are that many campus networks are not structured properly and can't effectively utilize high bandwidth connections. Many networks make heavy use of NAT and firewalls that limit performance. And many are built with unmanaged network equipment that provide no ability for monitoring or tuning the network. Campus networks support research and education, and your campus network needs to support research and education activities. These networks need to be flexible and open, and things you should consider. One is NAT makes it hard to do some things, for example, H323 video conferencing. Heavy use of filtering make it hard for researchers, teachers, and students to do interesting things. I will guarantee that if Stanford made heavy use of filtering, that innovative products such as Google would not exist today. As you think about your campus network, you never want your campus network to be the bottleneck. Typically in emerging regions, the bottleneck is your internet connection, and your internet connection might today be 1 megabit or 10 megabits or 20 megabits and your campus network will typically not be the bottleneck. But what happens when you get a gigabit connection? You must make sure that your campus network isn't the bottleneck. So right now today, you can absolutely make a plan to improve your network and remove all bottlenecks. So when you get that gigabit connection, it performs much better. And uh, the chancellor, when he goes back to his office, after doing the ribbon cutting for the gig connection, you will find that he has great performance. What you don't want to have happen is you uh, make the big splash and announcement that you have a gigabit connection now and the vice chancellor goes back to his office and he gets the same very poor performance because your campus network was the bottleneck.